Hello guys, welcome back to the Civil Engineering YouTube channel. Please subscribe our channel for more civil engineering videos. Today our lecture is about the quantity estimation of the uh, cement fine aggregate and the coarse aggregate uh, in the given column. Uh, this is the uh, column given to us with the cross section. Uh, dimensions are known to us. Uh, let's suppose this is the column uh, having the length or the depth we can say uh, is 5 meter and these are the two dimension cross section of this column here the one dimension is uh, 350 mm while the another dimension is 300 mm or we can say uh, this is 0.3 meter and this is uh, 0.35 meter right and we are interested uh, to find the quantity of the cement uh, sand and the coarse aggregate and this uh, seam in this column given to us. Now let's assume uh, that the, uh, the concrete which is poured in this column is of the ratio of 1, ratio 2, ratio 4. I just take an example uh, that we pour the concrete of uh, this ratio in which the first ratio represents the cement, uh, the second ratio represents the fine aggregate or we can say the sand and the third ratio it shows the coarse aggregate coarse aggregate so this ratio concrete is poured in this column and we are now uh, interested to find how much cement is uh, placed in this uh, concrete column and how much sand and how much the coarse aggregate uh, first of all uh, we should uh, we should add these ratios to get the total amount of the uh, ratio so by adding this 1 plus 2 plus 4 we will get the total ratio is equal to the C1. Now we will use this ratio uh, to find the quantity of the cement, to find the quantity of the sand and to find, to find the quantity of the coarse aggregate. Uh, so first of all I will find the volume of this, uh, of this column. The volume of this column can be found out by the formula volume by multiplying the three dimensions at uh, the length 5 meter with the two dimensions 0 0.35 and 0 0.3 0.35 and 0.3 so we will get the total uh, volume of this column uh, which comes out to be uh, 0.52 cubic meter so this amount of the uh, concrete we can say is poured in this column and this is the uh, and this is the width volume of the column width volume of the concrete in this uh, in this column now, as we know that uh, we, we are always interested in to find the uh, dry volume of the concrete uh, and what we do, uh, we multiply to find the dry volume of the co concrete, uh, we, we multiply the factor 1.5 with the width volume to find the dry volume. So uh, we will get the required dry volume uh, of the concrete poured into that column. And from where this vector comes, I will upload the video, you can check the description, I will give the link in the description, you can find out there uh, by uh, that where this vector comes from. So by multiplying the 1.54, right, with the uh, wet volume, we will get the dry volume, and this comes out to be 0 0.78 cubic meter. So this amount of volume, a dry volume, is placed in this column. Now, how much cement, how much sand, and how much coarse aggregate is involved in this column? So I will found I will find one by one now. Now, is we found out that the wet volume is equal to the 0.52 and the dry volume of the concrete is 0.78. So now I'm interested to find out the uh, cement quantity. So the cement quantity can be found out by a formula which is equal to the uh, first of all the this the cement. Is one ratio is used in this concrete so we, we, we will write here the one divided it by the seven which is the total amount of the uh, total amount of the ratio and multiplying it with the dry volume which is the 0.78 so by multiplying and dividing these quantities uh, we get out the uh, cement quantity is a uh, 0.11 cubic meter so and it means that 0.11 cubic meter uh, cement is used in this concrete uh, in this concrete column, which is a 5 meter and having dimensions of 0.35 and 0.3 meter, while the total volume is 0.7 meter. So only 0.1 meter is the cement quantity in this concrete volume. 
the quantity of the oxane or the fine aggregate uh, like the two as we see here uh, can be also found out to find out the uh, quantity of the fine aggregate or the sand it's very really easy like uh, this way uh, by dividing the two which is the sand ratio dividing it by the total ratio this is the total ratio and multiplying it with the uh, total volume which is the 0.78 so 0.78 here and we will get the uh, the quantity of the sand here used and it comes out to be 0.22 cubic meter so this amount of the uh, volume is uh, sand is used in this concrete uh, column now to find the uh, the quantity of the aggregate the co how much coarse aggregate is used uh, we can find out simply uh, by uh, by using this ratio so the coarse aggregate can be found out is equal to the the ratio of the coarse aggregate is 4 and the total ratio is 7 and multiplying it with the total dry volume which is 0 0.78 so we will get the 0.44 cubic meter so it means the coarse aggregate is more used in this concrete column 0.44 which is more than the 0.22 and 0.11 it means because uh, the uh, ratio of the uh, coarse aggregate is high so the more volume of the coarse aggregate is used here in this column so this was all about the uh, how we find the uh, quantity estimation of the uh, concrete column and and i will upload more videos soon and don't forget to subscribe our channel for more videos and if you have any confusion uh, please feel free uh, to comment and thanks for watching our video